you know, back in the 70s, it used to be, uh, we lost the, we lost the hardware store. Oh, the town's, the town's going to lose. We're never, we're going to dissolve. It's never going to happen. But they keep going. And then, and then it's the grocery store. Oh, we lost the grocery store. What are we going to do? There's a decline of community. And then it's the post office. You know, we lost the post office. But you need, we need to get to a point where we can say, what, what, what's, what's the new thing we're going to be? Um, it's not going to be the way it used to be. Get over it. We need to figure out what's next. What's the new part? And some of these communities are able to do that. I know myself and a lot of other people that are in the rural development industry at University of Minnesota Extension and the Minnesota Initiative Foundations and the RDCs, we really try and practice that focus on your assets, be positive. What do you have around you that's really of worth? And that really sets things in motion a little bit better, really trying to change that narrative of, you know what, we have great lakes out here, great rivers, the environment is great, some amazing parks, great schools. Um, just really trying to like prop those things up that are big deals. And once a community starts to look at those assets in that way, the development starts to happen. Things start to happen a little bit. You get this renewed energy.